Hello everyone, welcome back to Positron Plays Terra Enigma. Alright, so we are back in Loran. I am going to catch up, catch up on continuity things. Um, I went back and I got the bronze pike, so you see here. Uh, it's just a standard pike, it was from the vendor in Loran. And we had those Madrox from Neo Tokyo as well, so... This is back exactly where we were in Loran, but we have all of those items uh, that we previously had skipped by. Uh, this... Looks scary. Let's not do that. Oh my, okay, so we get hit like as soon as we come into this room. I don't oh, oh dear. That is a little zombie girl, and we just blew her head off. We got it back though. Wait, it blows up? Weird. Okay. We can pick up and throw these pots. It seems like we can hide under these tables if we need to. That does seem to be a mechanic that's unique to here. Um, I'm tempted, honestly, to try to fall down here. See where it takes us? Oh, okay, so this is that place, that room we saw before. I was like, oh, this room must be for something. But apparently it's just for a place to land. I'm actually not sure if this is better than... Um, that was not the right button. That was a big waste of a medium bulb. I'm sure this is actually better than the fire pike here, to be honest. And that was a crit, so it's kind of hard to tell, but... Yeah, I think the fire pike might do more damage here. Oh, okay, that table was alive. Good to know. Uh, I'm gonna get like a good, not a good test. Where the hell are we anyway? Oh, but who is, wait a minute. Who we get to you? Oh, okay, now I can crawl under here, right? No? Really? Oh, okay, here we go. Yeah, what are you doing here? So you're not a zombie. Huh. So that's the damage that that does. Man, I'm gonna keep doing that now. I'm trying to think of what I was just playing that that was the menu, but that's gonna mess me up a lot. I was playing uh, In Existence, which is a little Metroidvania that just came out recently. Is... Where did Temjin get buried? Because I'm, I'm guessing that he can go pick up his stuff. Although, if this is a dead end, we might want to head out north first to Mei Lin's place. See what happened to her. Anything. Oh, can I not get back there now? Oh dear. Hmm. That could be an issue. Can't actually be totally closed off, can it? This is actually pretty vicious. Also really hard to see. Did we ever go to this side of the town originally? Or was this side of the town even a thing originally? All sorts of chan chan scattered glassine dust. I actually know what that does. See yeah, a Magirock back there though. Oh, hi. Or poisoned. That's a bummer. Poison eventually wear off.
Yeah, I do wonder what was in Mei Lin's house there that I hopefully we didn't permanently miss. I have to see if I can get back around there. Yeah, we can move these boxes. Poison cure. Let me get to this treasure chest. I think that was something I botched. Let me come back in here. Yeah, okay, I see. I think. Do one of these. There we go. Oh, we get the rags? Smelly, filthy, ragged clothes. I'm sure those actually have a purpose, but for right now, it's not seeming like a good option. Unless it's something like the zombies don't attack you if you're wearing the rags. I suppose I could try that out. Go in here. You guys not care about me because I'm got rags on? Oh no, you are definitely still upset with my existence. Um... Oh, did I not buy the monk armor in this continuity? I think I might not have. Well, that's that's actually a big error on my part. Yeah, I think I might have forgotten to buy the monk armor. Is that right? Yeah, because that would have been better than what we have here. So that's a, that's a small mistake. We should be able to still get that. Just not going to have it for the purposes of this dungeon. Look at these weird burrowing guys. Oh, we turned that one upside down. Guess that's how we have to actually damage them. We can damage them when they're underground, though. Oh, okay. Oh, alright, I see. So now we can loop back around. That makes sense. Alright, there was nothing else here, right? And that poison is, um, kind of a pain. Must say. All right, so now if we jump down here, we'll be able to get back up where we want to go. Got a decent amount of gems too, that was 21 gems I think there. Little table. We want to head up to Maylin. Never did figure out how to get that uh, that Madrock up there either. The north part of town. That zombie was in bed. Hey, we leveled up. Nice. Play team. I'm sure there's gonna be something back here, or maybe at least we can get past where she was standing before, because remember she was blocking our path previously. I 
Nothing here? Oh, okay. Red scarf. Maylin scarf. There was a dog here. We could use this scent to find Maylin. Turbo. I guess we gotta go find Turbo. Give him this scarf. Question is, where is Turbo? I'd also like to find where the cemetery is. Whoops. Bit of vacuum power on those doors. I don't know why I did that. Crazy? Why couldn't I move that that way? I guess I don't have to. I am crazy, apparently. There's Temjin, but where is his stuff? a lot of crits and I like almost an abnormal amount actually. Assuming we still can't jump down the well or anything. I would like to find this Magirock, though. What was that? It wasn't here. It was the next place over, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. How do we get that? Got to be like a hidden door or something around here. Maybe back here. That poison is a pain, I must say. Hmm. Can't push those boxes. Unless we loop back around here at some point. Or there's a hidden door somewhere in here. If I was a hidden door, I would be down here. If I was a hidden door, my life would be pretty damn weird. Let's try this. Nothing. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. I might have to just leave that one behind. I mean, if we leave one behind one Magirock, it's not the end of the world. I just would like to get it if possible. I just have no idea where it actually is, though. As soon as our health starts beeping, we'll use a grass pin also. Something to lose your head over. I mean, come on, you knew that joke was coming at some point, right? Hmm. Oh, I didn't realize this was a path at first. Treasure chest? A light rod? Is that like a holy damage type of thing? Because I bet that's good against zombies. Staff the glowing tip. 
Okay. Oh, fancy. Yeah, there's a Madrock. What the hell's that other one? Boy, that thing is super annoying. Is it ever gonna stop? Let's use our uh, grass pin here. We have six of them. I actually picked up a few more uh, when I was backtracking, so. This is always a full heal, so we're in pretty good shape. Oh yeah, it definitely does more damage. How the hell do you get to this Magirock? Hoping this area doesn't close off permanently once we kind of solve the, the issue here. So much nicer indoors without that crazy uh, orcs, huh? This is the name of that enemy. Hey, another Madrock. Oh, they're just kind of handing them to us now. hidden path back here, perhaps? What do we have in this building? Uh, jail of some sort? Very strange. Oh, new enemies. Ghost appeared from the armor. Oh no, it's the ghost. I've been abducted? Pardon? Oh god. Oh, that's interesting. Huh. Well, that's gonna be a problem. Nothing else over What the hell do we do about being abducted? Other than not let the ghosts touch us, which is easier said than done, or just not kill those armors. Hmm, maybe we just bypass these armors for now? Some movable boxes here. Back outside on the east side. Assuming we can. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This actually goes downstairs even. Oh, hey, what are you doing here? Yeah. There should be a writer's room. Monsters destroyed the town. Well, that's a bummer. Seal said protect oneself from ghosts. Oh, okay. Um, oh, it's the same one. Yeah, so where do we get that? Where do we get that ghost protection seal? Didn't seem that great. Oh, we can sleep here. Um, that might be dangerous. Hmm. 
That's a nice little rest spot. That must be a place we can fall down. And we'll certainly try that. More of these ghost armors. Ah, we probably have to fall down there to get there. Maybe that treasure chest contains whatever the item is we need to not get captured. Yeah, the Holy Seal. Okay, here we go. I assume that's like the uh, Sleepy Seal. Sleepless Seal or whatever the heck it was called. Wards off ghosts. Yeah, we'll quit this. Uh, no. But I assume now we can safely destroy these, relatively speaking. Killing the ghost still seems like a huge pain in the butt, though. Oh, can we... Oh. I guess we can't harm the ghost and they can't harm us now? Strange. Very strange. Now what the hell do we do? Hmm. I mean, we can go back to that room with the ghost, but... What does that do for actual progress? I'm not entirely sure. Yeah, so if we destroy these, does it do anything for us? Doesn't seem to. Hmm. Must be something we can do now that we have that, though. Oh, I wonder, do we need to talk to the guy now that we have that seal? I didn't even think of that. Thought I blocked the door there for a second. Yeah, let's see if we can talk to him now that we have the- whoa. That stuns me, it's a little scary. Boy, they love putting these things right inside the doors here. We can take a sleep here too. Yeah. Hmm. I mean, mainly we need to find Turbo, but... Where the heck is he? We haven't found Temjin's stuff either. It makes me think that we're missing a part of this area. Somewhere I haven't been yet. Man, those are really hard to see when they're just crawling around 
I'm um, underneath the sand like that. The big empty area. to pause here and just wander around and figure out where it is I need to go, so sit tight for a moment. Okay, so the trick is remembering that there was someone building a door here earlier, now we can see the zombies going into it, so that's a little tricky if you didn't remember that. Presumably this will take us through the rest of the area here. Maybe we can get that other Magirock, too? Hope so, at least. Alright, ghosts can't do anything to us. Oh yeah, this the area would be annoying, if not impossible, without the seal. They head back upstairs, so... This is definitely weaker than the Bronze Pike. But it does number on zombies. Wow, we level up again. These things must give a lot of experience. Kind of crazy. I don't think we've leveled up that quickly in a long time. We're on the north side now. Um... Get back down to the other areas where that match rock would be. Treasure chest back there. Go through here? Yeah, a little hidden passageway maybe? Maybe not so hidden actually. I guess we'll go in this door first. Building here. Ah, treasure chest. 178 gems. Okay, we'll take it. Free money is good. Hmm. No hidden things there. I want to get to that treasure chest. I guess we have to go around. This is actually pretty huge. Did not expect that. A little bit of SNES slowdown there. This is massive. There's another uh, chimney there, too. Hey, a Madrock. And ghost armor. That's weird. Huh. Well, that's really strange. I wonder what the significance of that is. Oh, uh, whoops. Did not mean to slide back into the stairwell there. Not recommend sliding downstairs.
Oh my, these enemies are vicious. Damn good thing I have a lot of healing right now. not hit this guy. There we go. So we can destroy these, but just not that other one. Nothing here. A lot of dead ends in this, uh, this town too, I'm noticing. Oh my god, these things are insane. Outta here. Actually, they hit me before I even come out of the animation for the stairs. Right, we need to... Oh my god. grass pin here immediately. Holy cow. Stun locked on those is nuts. Probably equip my holy seal again, just in case. I guess we'll head back down going to this chimney here. A much bigger house than I expected. I wonder if Mei Lin is hiding in that armor. That's why we can't do anything with it. But we can't find that out until we get Turbo to sniff her out. It's kind of my guess. Oh, that's a... Uh, that's a nothing. Well, let's continue wandering around here. Uh, there's a smaller house here. Hey, a treasure chest. And potentially a chimney door. Treasure chest contains... Ooh, a large bulb. That's the first time we've seen one of those, actually. Even though I'm pretty sure early on I was calling medium bulbs large bulbs. Mostly because I didn't know any better. Man, this place is so enormous. So mostly when you consider all the houses, or almost all the houses have upstairs and downstairs. On of zombies here. Hey, is that treasure chest? Strength potion. Nice. Take it. Silly that you even get an option to equip that. Oh, I suppose that's one of those things. I mean, the items are just uniform, so. Probably every item that you get that it's going to appear in that slot has to be equipable. That was... I'm trying to make sure I'm not getting myself lost here in terms of what I have and have not explored. There's an awful lot of stuff. Have I been through these before? I don't think so. This looks like a dead end. Well, we're certainly earning a lot of money this way. A couple more houses to explore here. Ooh, there's another Magirock. So many. Or like our third or fourth one in this town? We know there's at least one more, too. I wonder if this connects to... Yeah, speaking of which, there we go. Okay. Ah, oh, the cemetery. Okay, so I'm assuming we're going to be able to find Timjin's grave here. At which point we will basically have no respect for the dead and his money.
Ah, Temjin's grave. Something gleamed in the grave. 500? Whoa, that's actually a lot. Nice. So, I guess we made the right decision there. I'm assuming if you just say, give it to me, that he leaves you literally nothing. Oh, hi, Turbo. Maitland's mutt? That's not very nice. Oh, I guess we actually have to equip the, uh, the scarf. Oh, okay. Huh. Well, let's go back to that, where that armor was. Oh. We have to follow now. Oh boy, you are a very slow dog. This is gonna be like the lion all over again, isn't it? Not the fancy music this time. Looks like he can't be hurt though, so that's a plus. I'm, yeah, I'm guessing he's gonna be going back to that big house. But we'll see. Or make sure not to accidentally go off the screen either. This was the house, right? Yeah, okay. Oh, that's neat. I'm actually kind of glad I figured that out. I suppose it was pretty obvious, but still. That was Maylin saying Turbo. I just accidentally skipped past it there. Oh, she's a ghost. Or maybe? Oh, no, I think she's okay, other than routing tears everywhere. Whoa, hey! That voice. Oh, weird. A little life lesson from Maylin's mom ghost. Oh, okay. Well, I guess you're still a brat. Now what? Uh... Do we... Hmm... Oh, are all the zombies gone now? Oh! Hello. It's Mayhu. I hope so. Yeah, the lost desert. Notice that. Oh, ask the roof from the nomads camped outside the desert. Was those people that told me to go away before? Oh, and it puts us right back out here. That's kind of nice. Oh, hey there. 
Still hanging out. Going. Plan to return to Europe and write my travel journal. Group of nomads near Taklama? Hmm. I agree with that. Well, I guess that's it for Loran. Let's just bring us back out there? Yeah, so next time we'll go probably talk to some nomads and explore around a bit and see if we can get through that desert. So, thank you for watching. See you soon.